everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a makeup tutorial. Finally, another makeup tutorial for me. A lot of you have been asking me for makeup tutorials because on I used to do lots and lots of makeup tutorials. But I don't have any inspiration. And then I saw um, this video of Crispy that applied to pink makeup, like pink smokey eye. So I was inspired by that, and I created this pink smokey eye as well. Pero yung sa akin, sa lower lash line, it looks a bit different, parang medyo grungy, and I don't know, it just... When I look at this makeup, it just reminds me of dolly makeup, parang Barbie doll, kasi pinapalaki niya yung mata ko. So yun, I just went with the flow, I went ahead and I got like my colorful eyeshadow palette, and I created this nice pink smokey eye. It's very, very easy to do. Um, I think it's a bonga shot. And I did not do much color with the rest of the face and with the lip as well. Para yung lahat ng attention talaga in nasa eyes lang. So, yun. I hope you like this look, guys. If you will like it or if you like it right now, please give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe as well. I love you all so much. And if you want to know how I did this makeup look right here, just keep on watching. Alright, so na tayo mapaligoy, ligoy pa. Let's just move right into the tutorial. I'm taking my Beach Cosmetics Eye on the 60s eyeshadow palette. And I'm taking this cream shade right here. you my lips, yes. And then I'm going to apply that all over the lid up to the brow bone. I'm just going to set the concealer that I put on my lid. Kasi I primed my lids with the concealer. Kasi wala lang. I just cannot be bothered to use a real eyeshadow primer. So yon. Um, this is just going to help us have a powdery base para mas madaling magblend ng eyeshadows later on. Diba? Bonga. And then I'm going to take this light pink shade. Yes, yung my lips pa rin. And then I'm going to apply that all over the crease area. Like the upper crease area para mag siya as a transition color. Just like what I said sa intro, I just wanted to have like a nicely blown out pink smoky makeup look. So I thought of applying this light pink shade first para again mag siya as a transition shade. Para hindi tayo ganun mahirapan sa dark pink shade later on. And then I'm just applying that using a um, blending brush. This is from Beauty Cosmetics. I'm blending as I go and as you can see, parang fineflick ko yung brush outwards para parang magwing out siya and then it will help extend our eye as well. Diba? Mga tricks, tricks natin. Bonga. Char. <laughs> and then I'm going to take the dark pink shade in the same palette. Yung my lips pa rin. Yes, yan. And I'm going to apply that only on the outer V or the most outer part of of my eyelid as you can see tapos i drag ko lang siya paloob ng konti mga up to the outer thirds lang ng aking eye para magbigay siya ng konting depth and dimension sa ating eye kahit na pink lang naman yung ating makeup look we still want to have some depth and dimension diba para para maging konting deep set pa rin yung eyes natin, di ba? Para may drama pa rin. And then, taking the initial blending brush that we used for the light pink shade, with no additional product, I'm just going to blend out the dark pink shade. Tapos, parang idadrag ko rin siya pa loob ng mas konti pa para wala lang mag... Bigay lang siya ng parang ombre look. So, from dark pink to light pink, di ba? Then, I'm going to take... This is actually a lip brush. <laughs> Gusto ko lang siya for detail work kasi ang liit niya, tapos super precise. So, I took the dark pink shade, tapos nilagay ko siya sa lower lash line ko. Um, I made sure na yung pinaka-dark na part is the outer... Like, outer... Outer half. <laughs> I can't talk today. It's the outer half of my lower lash line. So, kung konti lang yung product sa brush ko, yun yung nilalagay ko sa inner part ng aking lower lash line. Tapos, ibe-blend out ko siya. This is actually a shader brush from Beige Cosmetics. Pero, since medyo fluffy yung ano niya, yung ends niya. Ends ba? Parang ba yung sinasabi ko? I used that to blend out the dark pink shade. And I put a bit of light pink shade there as well. Yun nga lang medyo naging parang Harley Quinn yung itsura ko dito. Pero, it's okay. I actually fixed that with some powder later on. After this one, I am going to take the Jumbo Eye Pencil from NYX. This is in the shade Milk. Tapos, ilalagay ko yan dun sa, ano ko, sa lower waterline para wala lang magbigay ng konting funness char. Is that a word? Funness sa aking makeup look. And this will also help to brighten up my eyes kasi 
you know, if you use like pinks or reds sa yung eyes, like for a makeup look, it may tend to make you look sick. So, this is a great trick para hindi ka magmukhang may sakit kung gusto mong gamayin ng pink or reds sa iyong makeup look. Lagyan mo lang ng white line sa iyong lower waterline para mas maguka. Para mas mugha. Para mas magmukha kang more alive. And then, of course, mag-eyeliner tayo. This is the e.l.f. liquid liner in black. And I'm not actually doing my signature cat eye for today. Um, ang ginagawa ko lang is ini-extend ko lang siya ng konti pa straight. Tapos, I'm just going to flick it out just a tiny bit para bago naman yung eyeliner natin ngayon. Also, I think this will also help give you a more rounder shape sa yung eyes. And it will help make it look more innocent. Tapos, para mas lumaki pa yung eyes natin tignan, I applied black eyeliner sa half lang ng lower lash line ko. Tapos, para hindi siya ganun ka-harsh, I went ahead and blended it out with an angled brush. Kaya lang, after I blended it out with this angled brush, nakita ko na parang naging gray siya. So, I applied this black shadow still from the same palette. Oh, di ba? Laki na ng mata natin. And then, let's go ahead and move on to contouring! My favorite. Um, I'm using the Shawil Perfect Powder in the shade number 3. And this is a brush that I got from my Everyday Mineral set. I really love it. Pero feeling ko mas maganda siya for cream contouring compared to powder contouring. Pero okay na rin. It works. It does the job. I'm just going to apply that on the hollows of my cheeks. Cheekbones. No. Hollows on cheeks, cheekbones. No. Hollows of the cheeks, jawline, temples, and forehead. Um, I don't know why, pero hindi ako nag-nose contour ngayon. I don't know. Siguro nakalimutan ko, pero okay lang naman. Walang problema. So, ayan. I'm going to apply that on the forehead as well to slim down my forehead, my landing strip forehead. And then, for blush, I'm taking the LOL Blush Duo in the shade Chateau Rose. Kinuha ko lang yung pinaka-light pink shade because I don't really want to add more color to the face kasi gusto ko yung attention ng mga tao or yung attention ng mga tao no, yung attention ng mata ng mga tao nasa ano ko lang, nasa eyes ko lang so, yon I want I wanted to have all the color on my eyes. Then for highlight I'm taking this Love and Beauty by Forever 21 Highlight and Blush Duo. Yung highlight lang yung ginamit ko kasi parang ano kasi itong highlight na to, medyo may pinky undertone siya. It's a pinky highlighter and I think it really goes well with this look like it ties the look together so i apply that on the highest points of my cheeks nose line nose line nose bridge and my cupid's bow para maging poppin ang cupid's bow natin at para umangat ang ating nose diba bongga now for the lips medyo nag struggle ako kasi i wanted to have pink lips pa rin pero gusto ko light pink lip para hindi siya ganun ka Bonga. So, first, ginamit ko yung NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream in the shade Milan. It didn't work. And then here, I'm using the EB Advance Liquid Lipstick in the shade Soft Lace. Still, didn't work. So, naghanap ako. And I found this Kiss Proof from Me Now. And I believe this one is in the shade number 11. Ilalagay ko sa description box ko. Everything will be in the description box below. So, kung may tanong kayo kung ano yung ginamit ko, andun lang po sa baba. So, yun. Ito na lang ginamit ko na lipstick. And I really like the look. Now, mind you guys, nag-apply ako ng cream concealer sa gitna ng lips ko to make my lips a bit more pouty. And naglagay din ako ng clear lip gloss. So, yun. Hindi ko na naano sa camera kasi wala lang. <laughs> Ewan ko kung bakit. So, this is the finished look, you guys. I hope you like it. Nagustuhan ko talaga siya. Pasensya na kayo sa nakatiwang-wang ko na eyeshadow. No. Eyelash, false eyelashes. Pasensya na kayo. But yeah, don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you enjoyed watching. And if you liked it, don't forget to click the like button as well. Also, leave me your comments in the comment section below. Thank you for watching. I love you guys so much. Mwah! Hey everyone! Oh, andyan pala kayo. Napuposing posing lang ako dito eh. <laughs> hey, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a brow tutorial or on how I do my brows just using brow powder. As you can see, wala pa akong brow product as of the moment. My brows are nude. They're naked right now. No, that can't be. Hindi pwede. Kailangan natin siyang lagyan ng damit, 